little bit here, it seems. What was scheduled to be our main event is happening right now. Audible called, and I certainly won't complain. Sometimes I eat dessert first. Introducing first, from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 175 pounds, Speedball Mike Bailey. Speedball Mike Bailey, standout wherever he goes. Always look forward to seeing him here in the state room and at West Coast Pro Wrestling. One of the absolute very best in the world. Such an innovator. Incredible competitor. Soaking it in from the fans here in the state room is the speedball. And yes, showing off lethal, lethal kicking ability. Sure, the strikes will be plentiful in this one, Veda. Show of respect to our ring announcer and official. His opponent from Osaka, Japan, weighing in at 105 kilograms, representing DDT Pro. He is a former five time KOD open weight champion. He is the future, the Japanese phenomenal, Konosuke Takeshita. Someone who I have said is quite possibly the best professional wrestler in the world. I've been saying it for years. He has been my long time favorite and I am so thrilled that he's having such a successful tour here in America and I am very excited to hear, see him here in the state room. Big fight feel and we are underway. Speedball Takeshita. 93 till infinity, and I think they feel it as well. The crowd electric, and they both know it. Something special on tap here, folks. Thank you so much for joining us on IWTV. James Kincaid alongside Veda Scott. And since Mike Bailey made his debut here at West Coast Pro, he's really had banger after banger. I have no doubt this will be another in that line, but this one really does feel special. It certainly does, and you see the sportsmanship to start things out. No surprise there, Whoa. and now we're underway. Oh! Keep your head on a swivel, or these two will do it for you with some of their striking ability. Oh my goodness. Right away, neither man afraid to fire. Unloading, and, and this is such an interesting Dynamic here. I'm not used to seeing somebody that might be able to go strike for strike quite like this with Speedball. Yes, and they both had exactly the same idea. Speedball going for a brain buster, but Takeshita trying for one of his own. Oh, got caught with a tackle. Did Speedball. Whoa. Oh, look at that athleticism Takeshita. from Mike Bailey. And not to be outdone, Takeshita showing oh, off his athletic ability. It. Yes. Caught. Caught Speedball right in the face. Maybe the bridge in the nose, maybe the jaw. And you notice that Takeshita, he went for a rear waist lock and Speedball got out of it immediately because Takeshita's German suplex hold is the most dangerous in all of her wrestling. He actually wrote his college thesis 
on the German suplex. That's how much he respects it. Speedball on the outside. Master class of the German speedball able to evade, able to get the oh. leg of Takeshita and able to wrench it over the apron here of the stateroom. And here comes the speedball moonsault from the inside to the outside. A little elevation sensation from Mike Bailey. A triangle moonsault connected. Takeshita, you can see his, his hand immediately going right to his leg. Yes. Keep an eye on that as this matchup continues. And these two know each other so well. I mean that on a professional level and a personal level as we heard Takeshita, of course, here representing DDT Pro Wrestling, but it's Mike Bailey who has done 19 tours of Japan, all with DDT. He and Takeshita have not just known each other, been friends for six years. They're also former tag team partners. They were KO. DDT Tag Team Champions. I mean, these two have such a long history. Long history, but no friends right now between the Whoa. ropes. Bell to bell, and that left leg. No! Oh! Oh! Dragon screw leg whip. Dikesha just crumbled. Strategy from Mike Bailey, gotta think maybe is to take away that, that jumping knee. Yeah. Smart, smart strategy from Speedball Mike Bailey going after that left whoa, whoa, knee whoa. of Takeshita continually, relentlessly. Because if you've been watching DDT or perhaps most recently AEW, Dark AEW Rampage, you've seen Takeshita making use of that jumping knee. Handed down to him from Junakiyama, by the way, and it's deadly. Absolutely deadly, and what a legend to have something handed down to you from. Takeshita really favoring, <laughs> favoring that left knee. See, trying to dig down deep, unloading that chop and going right back to his, his left leg. He is wounded right now, but still able to push through and able to fly! Oh! Flying Larian and Spiebel on the outside. No choice but to escape to the floor. Having to go to the floor, and now Takeshita going full throttle to the outside! Oh my goodness! And to fly like that, Takeshita. All gas, no brakes from Takeshita. And now it looks like, although he's still limping a bit, has really turned things around, tossing Speedball back inside. Takeshita throwing all caution to the wayside. Soaring out of the ring. Finding purchase on Mike Bailey and has changed the complexion of this matchup. And see, oh, oh. planting Mike Bailey and now Takesha up to the second rope. Feeding off the crowd as sent on from the second rope into the cover. Mike Bailey shoulders to the mat for two. Just a two count. And see, Takesha almost trying to knock that knee back into the place, trying to shake the cobwebs out. Get it rolling again. Oh. Russian leg sweep, holding Hold on. Yeah, modified, almost an octopus yeah. leg. And again, I will point out that this is Konosuke Takeshita on a bad leg. Yes. Doing whatever he can to keep Speedball grounded, but also very intelligently, although he's using his own legs for leverage, it's keeping him from having to stand. Yes, and, it, and he's got that that right arm yeah. of, of Speedball, which would be have the direct shot to the left leg. He's, he's got it hooked. So yeah, very, very smart wrestling from Takeshita here. Rolling into in the, the cover. cover. He's got a pin. No, two count only. And around we go into another pinning predicament. Mike Bailey able to reverse it. No, no, Takeshita countering into yet another hold. And there you see Bailey get to the ropes. And the applause for both these men. Knife edge chop from Speedball Mike Bailey. Takeshita seemingly impervious at the moment. Not able to get through the armor of the Japanese phenom. Mike Bailey, Mike Bailey stopped a little short. Oh. Takeshita saw it coming. Takeshita saw it coming. 
Bailey's in trouble. Big time trouble. He is in the danger zone. Mike Bailey nearly bent in half. And Mike Bailey, although I'm sure didn't feel good, able to at least escape for now. Yeah, Speedball just hung up to dry and now Takeshita I've climbing. Never, I've never seen the look whoa, in the eye of whoa. Speedball quite like that. Climbing oh. in a superplex from Takeshita. Float over into the cover. Could be three, no. Not yet. But Takeshita feeling it right now. All the momentum in his favor. Speedball in some deep water. And Speedball was, was almost reaching for the ropes. And again, Takeshita maybe going for a German, but Speedball behind. Trio of elbows and then Whoa. looking for three was Takeshita. Now you see the, the Speedball kicks, that flurry of strikes. Paying dividends for Speedball, Mike Bailey turning the tide. Finally, finally an opening here for Speedball. And you can see, you can see he's doing his best to recover as quickly as possible. And he sustained an incredible amount of damage courtesy of his opponent though, but still trying to measure Takeshita. Is Speedball suckered him in perhaps? Just such great quickness and agility from the Speedball. Weapon? No! Nobody home yet. Speedball able to roll through. Scores with that strike to the midsection, to the back of the head. Those educated feet of the speedball coming through when he needs them the most. Oh. Corkscrewing through the air into the cover. No. Takeshita kicking out, but Speedball really starting to string things together here. Did not connect with the ultimate weapon, but able to recover, and now I really think he needs to close this up now. Looking maybe for a, a buzzsaw kick. I think you're right. Whoa. I think he took a little bit of time to telegraph it. Takeshita countered. Right, just how much damage has been done to me. Looking buzzsaw kick, no. Maybe he'll. Oh, oh, they're just fate. going strike for strike now. Just eyeing one another. Oh, just a thud of skin on skin. Volley for volley in the middle of the ring. And again, it is rare to see somebody able to trade strikes with the likes of Speedball Mike Bailey, but that's exactly what we are getting right now. Oh, look at that Speedball. That one had some serious for you. Look, yes, it, it rocks yeah. Kesha. Both men just firing relentlessly. Oh! Reverberating off the walls of the stateroom. Speed, oh, oh he, he, he got him Blue by the ties. No. Wait, no! Countered by Speed, under the cover. Crucifix, man. Speed ball right back to the head. Pin falls, near falls, coming so quickly now. And Nakamura there's another. into a, hold on. Navarro special! Speedball absolutely sick, and is Takeshita gonna have to tap out? It is lapped on. And when you take into account the already injured leg of Konosuke Takeshita, this could be it. Absolutely. Mike Bailey put a lot in that strategy, and it could be about to deliver him the victory. Takeshita see, biting his own hand, trying to, trying to stave off the submission here. Takeshita's got to get to the ropes. Reaching, and he does. Bailey will have to break. Damage, you should think, must be already done, though. Here it was just the, the pure strength of Takeshita. He's able to drag himself to the ropes, but Bailey already back on his feet and going right back to work on that leg. He knows exactly what to do to implement his game plan for victory, does Speedball Mike Bailey. Starting to impose his will on Takeshita. Oh, oh, caught again. 
maybe once once too often, but <laughs> speedball just too fast. But neither man going quietly. Oh, green tea plunge right into the cover. Two. Nearly had him for three. Where is speedball getting this? Double knees. Double knees from the speedball. Back and forth we go. 93 till infinity. These two men might fight for infinity. And now Takeshi is slowly pulling himself up. That tornado kick, that connected. Hey, Takeshi going, going down in a heap, barely able to stand up. Looking for it again. A weapon, oh, oh. no, got caught, blue. Thunder bomb. bomb! Opting not to go for the cover was Takeshi. He countered into the blue thunder bomb. Yeah, countered into a blue thunder and Takeshi after he made, after the impact, he went right back to his leg. I don't, I don't think he was able to make the pin. He's using this moment of separation to maybe get a little bit of recovery time for himself. Creating a little bit of space, but needs to stay on Mike Bailey. That kick might do the trick. That might do the trick and a poison, poison Rana. Rana. A poison Rana from Takeshita. Sumato! Sumato finds the mark. Shades of Hadashima and Didi representing DDT oh. Pro Wrestling, but wait! The ring awareness, I thought the, the lights were going out for Mike Bailey, but he's able to roll away from the cover, and Veda, could, and, that, and that could be huge. That could that could save the matchup for, for Speedball. Yeah, you could see Takeshka reaching its fingertips oh, extended, be, but... Takeshka's gotta be careful. Could we see it jumping knee denied? Bailey on the outside, baseball slide into the moonsault! Mercy! Speedball needed that. He got it. Unbelievable. Everyone is down. Except everyone in the stateroom. Many standing, chanting, cheering the efforts of Takeshita and Speedball. Something has to give. You talk about your money's worth. You're talking about this match right here, Veda. But we, we don't want to see it end on the outside. Speedball limping, pulling himself into the ring. Speedball could be, could have some more cruel aerial intentions in mind, perhaps, or no, just content to return to the ring. Yeah, just getting himself to a place where he's not going to be counted out. And Takesha pulling himself back on the apron as well. Oh, oh, but Bailey sweeps the leg. Leg sweep connecting with, first and foremost, that injured left leg of Takeshita. Oh, Speed this is deadly. Speedball just gonna dismember both legs. Oh, no! Nailed oh, the it. double knees on the apron! And Takeshita just curled into a ball. Speedball is sick. This has to be it. Look. Ultima weapon with the chandelier. To catch the out of the way, low lariat. To catch the just evading disaster and defeat, able to get out of the way of the Ultima weapon for a third time, and rocking Mike Bailey. And now to catch the. You can see the drive and determination. Went for the jumping knee and it got caught again. Neither man able to oh. score with some of their most potent offense. That super kick might do the trick. Looking jumping knee again. Oh, it spilled to the outside. Nasty landing for Takeshita. Yeah, it came in with so much velocity that he launched himself to the outside. And now I think both of his knees could be shot. Yeah, I, I, we weren't able to see him hit the floor, but we could hear it. And now Bailey. I mean, that, that's Takeshita's best weapon might be taken away from him here. And Bailey climbing, but wait, Takeshita is climbing as well. What do they have in mind? Never, never good. This so precarious, so dangerous. Oh. Watch the chandelier. Oh, Lariat from the top rope. Bailey flipped all the way inside out, and now this has to be it. Takeshita sent Bailey spiraling from the top rope and down to the mat. And yes, Takeshita can sense it now, perhaps. 
That German suplex hold, but Bailey somehow. Oh, going right to that. Now both legs. He knows there's a target on both. Oh, oh my God! How did Takesta do that? From his knees. How is that humanly possible? The strength of Konosuke Takeshita jumping knee denied! Yet again, denial after denial, counter after counter, kick after kick from the speedball, but Takeshita oh, once again! Lariat from the knees! And another for good measure! Finally, Takeshita! Two! No! Oh. One shoulder up! Thought the three was coming down. What is it going to take? And now Bailey. What is it going to take? Well now. Wait, ducks the lariat. That's oh, knee. jumping knee. Jumping knee found the mark. And now he's gonna, is he gonna hit it? German suplex. Into the bridge and Two. into the three. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner of this match, Kornoske. Takasta! Konosuke Takesta! A winning debut here in the state room. What a match, what a fight! And look at this reaction. Drink in the state room, folks. Unbelievable. Spectacular. took everything that both these men had. Ultimately, Takeshita comes out the victor, but And you could hear, goodness. you could hear everyone in the state room chanting West Coast. And that, just a show of appreciation, not just for these competitors, but for West Coast Pro bringing a match of this caliber to the state room. That was the stuff of legend. And you see the speedball after that battle. Two of the very best gladiators in the world and the show of respect. And a please come back chant for Takeshita. That seems pretty obvious at this point. And now speedball stumbling back towards the ring. Speedball, the look in his eyes. You know he's been through it. Look at that. Shaking hands, let him brace. And look at the damage on the side of Speedball's face. What a moment. Again, the absolute stuff of legend here at 93 till infinity. I must concur with the request of the stateroom. <laughs> Please come back indeed. And I would say that if you're enjoying Konosuke Takeshita here tonight or with AEW, check out DDT Pro Wrestling. That's really his whole mission being here is to expose DDT to the rest of the world. Please check it out. You'll enjoy it. I promise. Unbelievable action. And oh, Takeshita wants a microphone. Got something to say. <sighs> I promise. I'll be back, thank you. <laughs> I love to hear that. 